Hey guys, uh, here with Billy. Uh, today I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different than my usual montages and such. I'm playing a game called Black Mesa. It is a uh, complete remake of Valve's Half Life. Uh, it's supposed to, I guess, just run better and altogether be better. Uh, I've played it a little bit before, just to kind of see how, like, how it compared. Um, I didn't really get too far into it before I kind of said screw it, but now I'm actually gonna play the entire thing. I'm gonna try and break it up to into like half hour segments or so. Uh, according to their website, which I will leave a link in the description, it is supposed to be over an eight hour game. So hopefully I can try and beat it before then. Um, I'm probably going to cheat every now and then just to kind of look for stuff because I do like to explore. Um, so yeah, let's get this started. And I apologize for any lag too. Uh, this game actually takes up a lot more memory and such than I thought. Like right now it's at one frame a second. So, <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Now I'm at zero frames a second. I have completely frozen. I hope I'm not skipping my voice around. That'd suck. I don't care if it freezes. That's fine. Just don't mess with my voice. Five frames, two, three. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, but like I was saying earlier, I played this before, so it's a it's a pretty good game. I don't like that you just start off in this little thing and you really can't go anywhere. That's about it. But like, I really want to explore everything. I have explored a little bit. I didn't actually explore good anything morning, up there. And welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. But there is a spot up here. This automated train is provided somewhere. for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa But I found a bunch of little Easter personnel. eggs, I guess. Uh, the, the pizza is, is a lie was my favorite one I found. 8:47 a.m. Current top side Hello, temperature friend. is 93 degrees with an estimated high of 100. And I hate five. the intro because it literally takes forever and you're stuck in this little area. Maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Oh my god, I hate this intro so much. And you can't skip it either. I actually never played the original Half-Life. I don't think. I know I played the second one. Oh, see there. That'll happen quite often too. I, I really hate it. I apologize for the squeaky noises my chair makes. It's uh really crappy. <sighs> it's an old chair though, I've had it for quite some time. Oh, there we go. I explored there. A guy doesn't do anything, he just sits there. And then there's a part around here somewhere with an elevator. This train is uh, I guess inbound is from level three dormitories to sector Actually, they kind of like parts of this. Control facilities. Because you'll see a guy. If your intended die destination in a is a high security area, will not die, but he's freaking out because like C, toxic waste. You will need to return to the central transit hub in in mm -hmm. area nine and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel and for processing the before you will be permitted me. into the high security she's, she's branch the of the thing. transit system. Actually, no clipped outside. That guy just walks up there, she just walks across, and he just sits there. They do nothing at all. Due 
to the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black as Mesa as transit think, system. It doesn't even go all the way to that wall over there. It just kind of goes to like the, over that little odd looking object that's shining. Oh god. <laughs> I did not see that coming. <laughs> Yeah, I cheated quite a bit. It goes to that shiny object down the hill, and that's as far as it goes. This this elevator Please right here. keep your limbs inside the train at right all that times. Do it doesn't go up. Oh, it does go up. Until what? the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. When I no clipped, it didn't go up. In the event of an emergency, I had to manually press the button. to remain to seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. You can pick those things up with a fizz gun. Don't ask me how I know that. Door. Caution. Open pit. That's nice. Can't look down very much. Oh, please, he's playing the game. Forgot to disable this. Whoops. <laughs> There goes the lag again. It's gonna do this every time the map changes a little bit too, because it's loading the rest of the map. And my processor isn't good enough to handle it. So it lags out a bit. And then my frame rate drops incredibly. Oh, I just get stuck. A reminder that the Black Mesa Ooh, Hazard same. Course Decathlon will commence. Oh yeah, the same. The names are still the same. Hours uh, in the level three facility. I'm pretty sure you the see flying. Like I said, it's really just a remake of the original game. So that's supposedly supposed to run better. Remember, more lives than yours may depend on your fitness. I love this part. I don't know why. It's just watching that thing come up and then just lays it. We're actually getting close to the uh, other guy. Now, be noticed that if you do get this game, uh, your experience you won't be the same as mine because I have certain mods installed. To the Black Mesa team. Uh, one of which openings are available in the areas of it's mostly handling. just like a and different map mods. It's Please not cheating Black or anything, although I probably will a little bit. If you have That's, an associate that comes with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruiting I team. I want to drive one of those things. The Black Mesa facility is an equal opportunity an employer. I don't think you can. It sucks a little bit. It's a giant fan. A reminder oh, to all right, Black down. Mesa personnel. I was really for the open up radiation or something. and biohazard screening are a requirement of now, continued I'm employment glad in the Black Mesa research I, uh, facility. Actually, like this game a little bit before. Your analysis or radiation uh, checkup it took me like a half hour to find if you the, feel uh, you have been exposed to radioactive or other the hazardous hazard suits materials a little bit. in the course of it your duties, like a half hour to find it. your radiation safety officer immediately. 
So, oh, this is the part where the guy is running. Watch, watch out this side of the screen. Your future depends on it. See, there he goes. He just runs up, banging on the door, and this guy's just casually touching stuff. Unfortunately, that's all you see of it. I'm pretty sure that guy dies. Now arriving at oh, Sector there we go. C test lab Finally, I can do something. Facilities. I think that's like a 10 minute intro. <laughs> it's horrible. The lag is so real with this game. And it happens a lot too. It's not just this game, it's like all the Valve games. With the exception of Gary's mod. If that even is a Valve game, I think it is. I think it's just the way the maps and everything are set up. I think this is usually where you'd have like a different loading screen. It wouldn't just like freeze up like this. Because now that I think about it, I'm playing. Morning, I'm Mr. Playing Freeman. And you're recording. It looks like you're Hello, running late. Yeah, thanks. I oh, can't spit it. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. I don't care. I was asked to Barney was. Must have finally caught up with him. That's not very nice. I remember what happened to Barney. Because of Halo, or not Halo? God, why did I say Halo? There's a Half-Life too. I know what happened to Barney. Hey, dude, let me in. Aw, oh, man, you cut the ponytail. Sellout. What? Did he just call me a sellout? <laughs> what? What a bitch. Hey, Mr. Freeman. Oh, hello. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about I don't know. 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having they some BSOD. problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you've gotten to your hazard suit. Well, thank you. What do you have to say? Hello, Dr. Freeman. Hello, Dr. Freeman. <laughs> yeah, so... Something I just realized, this game's probably going to take a lot more than, uh, the thermal protection system seems eight to hours, because I like to explore. Those TPS reports have gotten progressively worse. I mean, Hard to find good help these days. Yes, about yes. that. We're going to need you to here. come in this weekend. Oh, what? would you look at that. Freeman actually did show up for work this morning. Looks like somebody here owes me lunch. Good morning, Freeman. <laughs> He's so pissed. Hello. Big day today, eh, Freeman? I can't remember, but I think so. Good morning, Gordon. You are typing on that computer. I can clearly tell. The sample was just sent down to the test chamber. Awesome. Why are those two the same and then those two aren't? Oh no, it's not. This is security notices. That one's just the lab notice. Don't be ridiculous. What? Okay. Um. I can't remember. I want to think it's personnel. Oh, dang it! Now I'm gonna have to look for this thing all over again. Nope. Wait. Yes. This is where I go. I just gotta keep going. I think it's here. Yes, found it. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Um, oh, it's over here. It is. I found it. Press that button. Walk down here. Suit acquired. Yeah. An achievement I got last time. While trying to find the suit. Hello? Hello? Could somebody get me some toilet paper? Oh, thank heavens! I 
I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. <laughs> oh, okay, whatever. I got the door to close last time. Ah, I remember my days in the hazardous environment suit. <laughs> it sounded like he's gonna say something else. He just stopped. He's like, mm, nah, that's all right. I remember my days back like then. Are you oh, dude, I love tearing up this room last time. Morning, champ. Wait. Hello. Who? Watch this. Good heavens! What the hell? What the hell? I don't know why it did that. I just thought it was really cool. <laughs> you think you can fix the vending machine too, college boy? We will never get the end of this. Yeah, you fix that. Make like an atom and split. Can you access the mail server? I guess I'm not gonna do it. I knocked it. I managed to knock it over last time. I remember playing this part the first time, and it's like I recognized all these things from Prop Hunt. Hello, friends. Don't count on it. If anything, you'll just have more. Can this wait? You'll just have to wait until after the test. Listen. I'm only going to explain this to you one more time. If you have oh, that's this guy. Gordon, this had better be important. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, not. Okay, this I thought was really cool. Because then if you read it, you press escape to cancel and return to BIOS. And then press enter to close any application that's not responding. And then I thought it was really cool because it's hl2.exe which is basically what this launcher is called so when I hit enter nothing happens when I hit this uh, alright guys I apologize for that uh, something something went bad and I really don't know what happened uh, I didn't do that while I was recording so apparently that does bad things when I'm recording so I have to stop doing that <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't it be fantastic to get some readings for a change? Uh, also, these guys are really sassy in this game. I can't believe how far I got before I stopped re or before I realized I wasn't recording anymore. I made it quite a bit ahead. So now I completely forgot where I was going. Was it this way? I think it was this way. This guy doesn't let me through for some reason. Go right on through, sir. Oh. Um. Hmm. Okay. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Looks like you're in the barrel today. There's one of them that says I can't go through for some reason. I want to go through here. I feel like there's secret stuff hidden on the other side of there. First time I played this, I was screwing around and I fell out the front of this thing. So it took my health down quite a bit. Oh, here we go with the lag spike again. Oh, that's upsetting. I can't believe I got so far before I realized that I wasn't recording anymore. I don't know what color you guys see the counter as in the bottom corner, or if you see it at all. But for me, it's red, and when it's yellow, it's not recording. Hello, friends. You'll just have to wait until after the test. It just like, sounds like, so upset. Uh, plasma cells. We should harness the remaining photonic energy to ensure resonance control. 
double check the Brewster's plates angles and make sure he's super <laughs> clicking the on the do anything. What's up, Doc? Ready for another What's rousing that? day, Freeman? Let's make a bug's bunny reference. I'm not smug. I'm just better than you. Ooh, can. I couldn't even venture a guess. Yeah. Watch this. Keep your busy little hands to yourself, Freeman. Yeah. If another instrument malfunctions today, I'm going to explode. Please relax. Things could be much, much worse. I love my little can. I thought you got an achievement for putting in a trash you don't. It upset me. So ah, it. Gordon, there you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent Shut the sample up. down to the test chamber. Hello, we Kleiner. boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. Oh, there's clicks They're playing Gary's mod again. Gordon. In the test chamber. In right. The test chamber. Come on then. I'll walk you down. Will you walk me down? Eli has been busy making last minute preparations for the new experiment. Okay, go. Thank you, Kleiner. Oh, Jesus. Uh, this way. Greetings, Eli. Jesus. There's Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon. Good morning. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. These last minute changes, yeah. they're, they're a bit strange to just. Oh! It's about to go critical. What in the blazes is going on <sighs> with our equipment? <sighs> it was never meant to do this in the first place. Never meant to do this in the first place. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. You think I'm some kid? I don't know where to go anyways. To get it. There we go. Yeah, I had to hit this button. By Beckrell's ghost! The radiation level is off the charts. You know, this is far from the glory I had envisioned as an undergrad. How so? I've got two PhDs and an Ersted medal, and I find myself doing work best suited for an intern. Please, you do very meaningful work here. Really? Push that button. Walk over here. Push ah! this one. Stand and stare ah! at the screen. Walk back over there. Push another button. Again. Come now, uh, you're overreacting. Here we go. Yeah, what he said. Do what he said. I don't know how much longer <laughs> I can abide these perfunctory tasks. I need more time for, for myself. Ha. Huh. Don't kid yourself. You wouldn't know what to do with free time if you even had any. That tears it. I'm going to check with the office upstairs and see how many vacation days I've accrued over the past 25 years. It's high time I took a break from all this. Certainly. But before you do, activate the electron multiplier and report the reading from the micro channel plates. That's right, bitch. <laughs> I always liked watching that. I went through it earlier. Ah, Freeman. Oh. Wait, what? Look, stop. Look at his face. And then look at this. It's the same guy. Except this one doesn't have glasses on. Are you sure you checked the Egon attenuators? Come on, oh, there you are. Let me in. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. I've got VHS tapes. Oh, here he is. Ha. Oh. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, oh. Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample <laughs> we've <laughs> seen yet. And potentially the most unstable. Emergency pull lever no, to no. detonate As long as we follow standard release. insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. <laughs> Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't Gordon feel doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. <laughs> but I'm the administrator not. that nothing will go wrong. Yes. You're right. 
Gorgon. We have complete confidence in you. Uh, uh, well, go ahead. You're putting Let's a trust in, now. in the wrong person. <laughs> Alright, since this is a big part, I'm actually going to stop it right here. And uh, I'll start up another one. And I'll have this one edited together because it did crash a little bit in the middle. So I'll have it up in a few days or so. Or heck, I'll probably even have it up a little bit later today. Uh, if you like the video, comment, subscribe. Are you like waiting it. for something, Gordon? I was <laughs> just savoring the moment. It was sassy, One day aren't they? he'll look back to this as the beginning <laughs> of his illustrious career. Uh, There's yeah. no need for performance. Uh, I'll be posting exactly the rest of it and then the, over the next not. few days or so. You're a seasoned pro by uh, now. I'll let you know. So, have a good day, gentlemen, ladies. Other.